Okay, I was going to take a break, but apparently instead of turning this thing off, I've just turned it back on again. So let's just uh, take a look at something doing to do, do with um, the field, the energy in the electric field, right? Uh, and we're going to keep on looking at um, this system that we've looked at in a couple of other videos with a nice flat uniform charge distribution. And we're going to say, well, what is the electric field energy because of an infinite uniform charge distribution, right? And uh, this is instructed. All right, so we've got a got a um, uniform charge distribution, a uniformly charged uh, infinite flat sheet. Uh, we've got some sort of charge density so that's going to be sigma we want to find um, its electric field energy uh, u okay and so our concept here is going to be the energy density And the equation is, well, epsilon naught over two, well, little u, the energy density, energy density, little, little u instead of big u, epsilon naught over two, um, e squared. And the strategy here is pretty straightforward. Strategy uh, one is to find e. We're not going to spend any time finding E because I've got other videos for that. Um, then we find um, the lowercase u, right, the uh, density, the energy density of the field. And then we find um, big U by integration. Uh, this looks complicated, doesn't it? So E, we've already done this a couple of times, is equal to um, epsilon naught over 2, no, 1 over 2 epsilon naught, excuse me, sigma over 2 epsilon naught times the sine of Z, uh, Z hat, assuming that this is in the XY plane and this is the Z direction, right? And then for U, u is just going to be epsilon naught over 2 times the square of this, which is sigma squared over 4 epsilon squared. We can cancel that. So we have 8 epsilon. Here we have sigma squared. And that's our energy density, right? That's our energy density. Then we want to integrate this. We want to integrate this over all space. Um, and if we do that, we have a constant integrated over an infinite area, we get something that goes to infinity, right? And so that's no good. That's the correct answer, but it's not good. Um, that sort of means something like you're never going to have an infinite charge sheet, right, of uniform charge density. Uh, there's just not enough energy to put it together. All right, well. I hope that was instructive and fun and something that you can share with your friends. Uh, we'll talk about this again um, in class. Bye now.